the channel or welcome if you are new and welcome to episode 6 of the 7 toddler challenge Snow White and the 7 tot style. We're here with Snow White and Dopey today. We're flashing cards. Everyone seems to be doing really well today. Uh, Bashful is getting a bath over here from the nanny who is like Literally, he should be Prince Charming. Oh my god, and we have both Grumpy and Doc here using the potties. <laughs> that is really funny, actually, and kind of gross. So, who else do we have here? Oh, someone just went outside. Yeah, everyone seems to be doing really well. There goes Sleepy and Happy. So I thought we should take the toddlers to a park today. We haven't left a lot and everyone's needs are fine. So it's 10 a.m. Great time to go to a park that I have made. I've created a park called Magical Forest Playground with the Sims 4 toddler stuff. And I thought, why not take all the tots over there? Look, all their needs are doing a great you could use the potty if you have time. Oh gosh, you need help, don't you? Prince Charming, can you help us please? And you could also use the potty. You're gonna get help from Snow White. And then everyone else, yep, you're perfect. You could use a bath. Who is available? How about the nanny to give a bath to us? You just need to use the potty, but I guess you can just use your diaper. And you're sad because of Oh no, from playing with flashcards. You really didn't like that, did you? Oh well, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. Okay, let's just do the few interactions and then let's head off to the park. The park is adorable. Like I said, it's a magical playground. I mean, if I say so myself, it's adorable. <laughs> it's very nice and magical. I, I don't know, it's just very cute. So we're gonna go over there. It's actually perfect for this lot that they live in. The park would fit here perfectly. Fortunately, they live here, so I had to put it on another lot, but hopefully it looks fine in there too. This bathroom is busy. Okay, so she used her, apparently she used her, what is this called, diaper? That's okay. How are you doing in the bath? They like get this skill up or this need up super, super fast. Like, look at that, he's already done. So, can we have you change our diaper? That would be perfect. Uh, let's see, help diaper. Change our diaper before our hygiene goes to crap. These two are <laughs> on the potty. Hopefully they will get like potty level high enough soon. So that, what is she doing? So that they can use the potty by themselves. Are we gonna get our diaper changed? This bathroom is way too small for this. Three toddlers and three adults. Are you going to bed, little one? Are you tired? Okay, she's getting it changed. Perfect. He has gone to sleep, but I think his need is okay. So we can take him as soon as these two finish. We have both the yellow beanie toddlers here. How are you doing? You really are not going, are you? How about you, happy one? Happy one, you still haven't gone either. And their energy is a bit low, so maybe we'll go for like two hours in the park and that should be good. Sean is watching the telly. Okay, sure. Why not? We should also, oh, there's only one left and it goes bad very soon. Well, uh, put that away once you're done over there. Maybe someone can still eat it and I'll meet you guys at the park. Here we are, Magical Forest Playground. This is the one I made. I think it's adorable. Like it has a few little areas like over here are the picnic tables. Here you can use the grills. This is a little fire pit area where you can roast some marshmallows. We have a cute little natural pond. We have this playground thingy for the toddlers and over here this is my favorite area it's like a little cute picnic area with the pillows and the books there's a little bookshelf lots of clutter all around I love this place if I say so myself it's very cute so everyone run around do your thing we couldn't invite Sean unfortunately because we can only invite seven sims so oh, why are we hugging around the person 
this teenager with black makeup, what are you doing? The apple game is good. So how about we invite Sean to hang out over here? We can even invite, oh, we can't invite the prince. And why not? I don't know. Why are the toddlers just like, I mean, why are the adults staring at the toddlers? And who are you with green hair? One thing we haven't seen is like the imagination effects of this playground. I don't know why we've never seen them. I'm a bit confused about that. How about you go play with that and then see if we can see them because maybe I mean you probably need to have the toddler selected but like I'm not seeing any effects around this which is a bit weird because I would love to see them. How about you? Can we like what the heck? I swear in the trailer you can see like really cool effects coming out of this and it's really really cool but we've never seen them and I don't know why not. I don't know what's wrong with it but they're not there. Oh well. Did, uh, did Sean say he was coming? Yeah. Oh, Sean's busy right now. Doing what? Being a nanny to zero toddlers at our house? Oh my god, I love this place. Look at this. This is so colorful and cute. Here goes Sleepy using the slide on her own. I think she's that inquisitive toddler. Is she? I forget. She's still sad from what? A poly accident. Okay, people are getting a little bit hungry. Oh my god, Snow White was playing with Sneezy, but she doesn't need a Sneezy. She likes to play on her own. No, my tunnel! Oh, don't be you angry. Anyways, like I said, people are getting a little bit hungry, so we could make some food. So we could grill some. What's a good child food? Tofu dogs or grilled fruit? Let's do grilled fruit. That sounds really, really good. And oh my god, she's very, very playful. Oh my god, what if she became like hysteric? Oh, that'd be bad. Okay, soothing chimes. What's this one? Dollhouse fun. Okay, but we're gonna grill some food so the toddlers can grab it and eat some food if they're hungry. This, okay, yeah, this lot, like this lot is a little bit bigger than the area that I've made, but it looks still really cute here. I like it. We reach imagination skill level two and we're making a huge mess. They never do that at the house, actually. I wonder why not. But they don't. Oh my god, she's getting a bit tired. But yeah, I was reading your guys' comments and I got a lot of tips saying that if you read the toddlers to sleep, they don't see nightmares, which is a really great tip. I don't think we have time to read all the seven toddlers to sleep every night, but we could at least read a few of them to sleep. That should work. Okay, you put that right there. Sure, why not? Okay, who's hungry? Anybody? If you're hungry, come out and get some food. Grab a serving and you're okay, you're doing okay. You guys are just tired at 2.30 p.m. Gosh, okay, she was pretty much the only one really hungry. So the rest of them can just go around playing. They really are enjoying themselves here. This is so cute. So yeah, that was one of the comments that I saw. What else was there? I have the comments right here. If a toddler has very low attention and fun, you should have Snow White or someone else play with the toddler. That is right, it gets two of the needs up, which is really, really good. Playing takes a while, but that is a good tip. What else do we have here? Have your toddlers take a nap when they have nightmares? That is true. I don't know why I've never done that, because they can't sleep after nightmares, but they could take a nap. So that is something we should do. Here we have dog dancing to no music, but sure, whatever, whatever makes you happy, little one. Where did she go and eat? Oh my god, she went and eat, ate over here in this cutest area. I'm obsessed with this area. Look at her. Oh dear lord, cuteness overload. Okay, I'll take a little screenshot of that. Imagination skill level three. That is really good. How are my tots doing? Fine, you're just fine, okay? You're getting a bit tired. You're sad because of what? You had a nightmare in those 30 seconds that you were asleep. Okay, sorry, we can't put you to sleep right now while we're here. Dang, they're all really tired. Even she's tired. What is she doing? Oh, she's going to go fertilize the bush. Okay, sure. Why not? We could like flashcards with someone for a little while and then we could probably take them home after they are done. Having some fun over here at the park. I thought we were going to have to take them out at least once in this series, you know, so we're not just like stuck at the house the entire time. Oh, I saw flashcards. Teach animals. Let's do that. Everyone needs to go to sleep. Well, it's getting, it's getting darker. It's going to be nighttime or evening time soon, so I guess that's okay. 
she's crying over here. These two are fighting or something. Oh, we really need Prince Charming and Sean over here. <laughs> oh no, okay. I think we're gonna head home. This didn't go as well as planned, but that's okay. We still got to see this cute light. I love it. Okay, I need to stop saying I love it since I made it myself and yeah, but it is very, very cute. So if you guys want to download this, it is on the gallery under my username SimmerKittenYT or under the hashtag SimmerKitten and it's called Magical Forest Playground and I mainly use items from The Sims 4 toddler stuff. All right, let's go home before the kids get taken away from us. So I'll see you at home. All right, everyone is off to bed now. They're all running. <laughs> Look at all these toddlers. They're all quite sad. Okay, you happy can't run yet, apparently. But we are going to put them to bed now. So <laughs> they'll be okay. Oh, gosh. And we're going to read a bedtime story to Sleepy. And Grumpy over here is going to be asking for a bedtime story from Sean. Is he over here still? I didn't see him anywhere. Where is he? Where is the nanny? Oh, he's over there. Hello, welcome. Come back. Come read us a bedtime story. That would be very, very helpful. Snow White is reading one to Sleepy, so she won't have a nightmare. And now Grumpy's gonna have a bedtime story. Why is this pad, iPad, what's it called? The tablet? Why is it on when it's just on the ground? Oh my god, what is that? And someone is playing it? There's a ghost playing it? Oh my gosh. This is too much, guys. And what a mess is this place. I don't even know. Well, the toddlers are going to sleep at 5 p.m., which I guess it's okay. Oh, she finished reading the bedtime story? Which, no, you're not gonna read Grumpy to sleep. No, no, no. But we could read someone else to sleep. Like, I don't know. Who needs a bedtime story? Uh, you could use one. If you wake up, we'll read you to sleep. Yeah? How about that? Oh, let's see. Is she gonna wake up? anytime soon so we could read her to sleep that would be useful we need to care take care of snow white's needs as well she really is not waking up is she how about if we click wake up oh that's what is that what is that what is happening oh dear lord what the heck is going on there we go all right so now we can read her to sleep yeah Toddler care, read to sleep. There we go. Whoa, she's very uncomfortable. Hopefully she doesn't pass out before she does this. I didn't realize she was that low on energy. Hopefully she's okay. Sean read Grumpy to sleep. Okay, everyone's doing good. He's cleaning up a little bit, which is great because this place is a mess, like a real mess. Thankfully it's not a huge house, but it still gets pretty messy in here. But there we go. Last toddler going to bed. Three of them won't wake up from nightmares, and if the other one's two, we can read them another bedtime story. Is she just gonna like drift off to sleep? That's just, that is so cute. Let's watch her fall asleep because we're little creeps. Go to sleep, little Toby. Sleep well. Don't see any nightmares. We're reading you a story about scary dinosaurs and what is that? What is that? Like a wizard? I can't see. What? Are you gonna fall asleep anytime? What? What are you doing? What are you doing? What is she doing? What is she doing? Why didn't that put her to sleep? That makes no sense. All right, well, we're gonna use the toilet and then we're gonna go to sleep ASAP before we pass out. So <laughs> go to sleep, Snowy, you'll be okay. They're all sleeping now. He is learning something in his sleep. Is he the one who's bugging with this tablet? I don't know, but Something weird is going on here. <laughs> Anyways, I guess I will meet you guys when something exciting happens. Why is everyone spraying this bed? Like, what is wrong with this bed? It's, just, it's like Prince Charming really just like to sleep in a wet bed or something. I don't really know what's going on with that. But anyway. All right, the toddler's actually doing quite well. Now Dobby's up and she's really hungry. Everyone else is still asleep. But we did have Prince Charming make some food for us. So why are we asking for this guy to come pick us up? Well, he's coming. He's a good nanny. Hopefully he's going to give us some food. And not just like a sippy cup because that's not going to be helpful. I feel like that's exactly what you're going to do. 
no, nope, you just pick this up and put this down. That's what I mean by the others being a little bit buggy. Like, what's the point of that? But we have some Monte Carlo, Monte Cristo, sorry, sandwiches. I have no idea what those are, but they sound good. So she's going to have one of those. Snow White sleep is perfect now. So we should go take play in the bath. Oh my God, yes. You can play in the bath as an adult. I mean, I know she's childish, but... I've never seen this before. What's she gonna do? Is she gonna play with a toy or something? And she's wearing pants. This is the problem of CC. You're just playing with the water? What? What you up to? I don't really know. But she is in the bath. You do your thing. She needs to get her hygiene up. Then she's gonna have some food. And it's the middle of the night. Hopefully the toddlers will sleep a little bit longer. Maybe until like 5 a.m. That would be good. That's a little bit too early for them to wake up now. We are energized because of the sunny aspect trait, but I'm gonna put her back to sleep after she is done eating because everyone else is sleeping and her knees are just fine. So she might as well go back to sleep and we can work on Snow White's needs. She could have some food. Yep, grab a serving of that when she's done with her hygiene skill. skill? A level a need whichever it is and we have two men still over here prince charming is not asleep are you about to leave no you're about to have some food sure help yourself oh you're cleaning up after the toddler thank you very much we should get to know sean a little bit better but we're not about to have like a drama between like what is it called a love triangle between these three even though i'm kind of liking sean more than Prince Charming. What the heck? How is our bar 100% as well? How? What happened? Like, I gave with the toddlers because, like, he takes care of them, but this is no white we're talking about. Okay, well, I guess. <gasps> yes, can we give you a tip? Yes, you've been a great nanny. Here you go. Have a hundred simoleons. That's a pretty big tip to give. There you go. Yay! Oh, he says thanks. Well, you're welcome. Express admiration. Thank you for taking such good care of our thoughts and reveal a deep secret. We are actually running away from the evil queen who is trying to kill us. She thinks we're dead. We're hiding out here with the seven thoughts. I just found them in this cottage. I don't know what they were doing here all by themselves, but I have decided to take it upon myself to take care of them. That is our deep secret that we told him. <laughs> Anyways, make a flirtatious joke. Maybe not. Maybe not. Ask to move in. How can we do this when there's no place in the household? But we could become best friends. I think that would be really, really cute. So let's do that. And toddlers, everyone's still asleep. Good, good. We're enjoying our sandwich with a fork. Who is a sandwich with a fork? That is really weird. Why is she doing that? I don't know, that's a bit weird in front of this guy. Just just act normal, Snow White. Act normal. I know you're living here with seven Todds, and they're not really a good example, but still, you can do it. Are we going to become best friends or not? Can we just do this, become best friends? Cancel these other two. You are done eating. Very playful again. And here we go. Yes! Where the heck did he just appear from? Yay, best friends! Did you guys see? Where did he come from? I swear, he appeared out of nowhere. Maybe I imagined that, but like, kind of not. He just appeared out of nowhere. No idea what's going on. Anyways, we are best friends with the nanny now. Our relationship is going good with Prince Charming. We could do a little, a little hug. Sure, why not? Or a little, ooh, a little kiss. Maybe just an embrace. That would be a better... Yes, thank you for being here for us. Thank you for taking care of the house. Let's do... What can we do? Woohoo in a bush! Um, no. Let's make a flirtatious joke to him. Maybe we can go kiss him, like, over here. Just chat here. Not in front of the thoughts. That's a little bit weird. Her, she's up already. She saw a nightmare. Of course she did. Why are you not coming? Can we call him over? Uh... Invite to stay the night? Um, yes. <laughs> He's gonna stay here anyways. His bed is right here. Well, Doc, just close your eyes. Don't watch the adults kissing, okay? You're just a little tot. Uh, how can we do this? Oh, he's going away anyway. That's, that's perfect. Romance and 
Whoa, we got a lot of new options, but let's do kiss. I want them to kiss. Since last time was their first kiss. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Just sit down. That's that's not gonna work. For fist and dying love. No, not yet. We barely kissed him. Okay, little ones, don't don't look at us. Don't look at us. We're just trying to kiss her over here. If this is ever gonna work. Oh, is it working? There we go. Okay, we got we got them to kiss. That's all. That's all, everybody. I think that's gonna be it for today's episode. Anyways, we're at around 20 minutes, so that's good. Oh gosh, everyone is just waking up now, and they're super hungry. Grab a serving. You need a bath. Are you grabbing a serving? Where the heck are you? You're eating at your bed. Sure, why not? Very angry because you're tired. I mean, hungry. Take a serving. Okay, everyone is good. You are just sad from your dream, I assume. I can't click on her. Yep, there she is. Oh my god, he's so funny. I like him. Talk about favorite color. Can you do book help? That sounds cute. Let's do that one. Prince Charming is hungry. Okay, well, we're going to continue tomorrow to do this day. It's 6 a.m. almost, so we're going to continue that. Sorry, not tomorrow, but... We're going to continue in the next episode whenever that comes out. Let's see how many days until these ones age up. It is two days now. We are close to aging them up into kids, which I'm very, very excited about. Tell me in the comments what, what we should do in the next episode. If we should go do another lot with the tots or if it's just too much hassle since they're just super, super needy. Anyways, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And again, I love reading your guys' comments. So any tips or any feedback on this series is very much appreciated. Hope you guys did enjoy and I will see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye!